What are you doing to my clay? I didn't know you was home. Wow. <laughs>everybody welcome back to the channel um, I'm guessing by now you've probably met my my phallical sculpting girlfriend anyhow um, if you're new to the channel by all means hit that like and subscribe button so let's uh, let's go about with the uh, processing of bentonite clay out of kitty litter anyhow guys real quick the uh, the clay has been sitting here for like two or three days just sitting here and a fan's been blowing on it still got moisture in it and it's moldable it's really good quality clay from what I can tell from my research um, online because you know everything's true on the internet but um, I would show you just how well it's sculpting but um, this is not a NC-17 rated um, wow like it's not a NC-17 rated <laughs> channel, so... That looks like a poster. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Anyhow, go check out her channel, Blonde Jovi, Rock Solid Creations. Uh, I'll put a link to the description down in the, uh, to her channel down in the subscription. Get that out of my face. <laughs> All right, so here we go. All right, guys, the so one thing you're going to need is a way to process this clay, this uh, kitty litter. It's, it's in a clumped up form, and... Uh, so it doesn't work too well like that. And um, <clears throat> so you're going to need something to crush it down into like a dust. And people talk about fall mills and they talk about pounding it with a hammer. And you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit too lazy for all that. So um, let me show you a very special tool that you're going to need to do this. It makes it so much easier. Bam! There it is. There it is. Wait a minute. It's missing a piece. A blender. It's all you need. Goodwill, five bucks. Can't beat it. This is going to make life a whole lot easier. Well, not life. It'll make this a whole lot easier. Watch this. All right. So let's uh, let's plug her in. All right. Oh come on. I can hear it buzzing. Maybe it's just jammed up. <laughs> All right, let's plug it in and check it out for real. Cool deal. All right, so here we go. I am going to dump some uh, some cat litter in here, and we're going to ground this up into a powder. You want to get it fine. Now there may still be some insecurities in here. But we're going to go all right, so let's see here. I don't know how much to put in here. But I'm just going to put handful after handful after freaking handful. <clears throat> all right, I'm only going to do about halfway for right now. How this kid a little good long way? Man, I only used a little bit out of this and, and I got don't show that I got all that and I, I still got more it's going so here we go put my handy dandy top hat on here
Let's see what we got. Look at there. Wow. Nice. Does. So, that's how you process your uh, kitty litter to go ahead and, uh, and get it ready. Now, after this, you're going to do the same thing that you did to make sure that there's no impurities in it. You will uh, hydrate it in the water, stir it around, and um, then you will screen it in a screen, like I showed you in other videos, to get any sand or anything that might be in there. So, there you go. Now, uh, now we can continue on with some things. I still need to know how much dookie to put in there. A person can't seem to keep their hands off the clay. So... <clears throat> I need to check to see exactly what it did to these uh, stainless steel blades in here. So I'm just going to dump this in this bucket. And then... So one good thing about it is this thing will keep that sucker, that dust, from happening. So here we are. Um, it's actually in really good condition. No big chunks missing out of it or anything. So and uh, it'll do the trick. I think this will be all right. So, uh, with this, not only can you make clay with, but you can also um, use it for a green sand, uh, which is what I'm going to use, another thing I'm going to use it for. So, also, bentonite clay has some, some health deals in it. I don't know, you're supposed to be able to put it on your face and it makes you look younger, prettier. I don't know, I'd have to take a bath in this stuff in order for it to work for me. Anyhow... Anything you want to say? No? I'm still not seeing my sculpture. <laughs> no. I'm turning that into a fire brick. Don't get used to it. <laughs> so i got to make her some of her own. But, uh, <clears throat> here's my come on, I want to lick you. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, so that's pretty much it. Um, I told you I'd do it for processing uh, bed and I clay out of kitty litter. And it's, it's just that simple. So, um, now, there might be some fine sand or something in it, so you have to process it like you process regular clay. Just remember, sand falls faster than clay does, so you'll stir it up, uh, strain it, go ahead and strain it, just in case there's been any big organics, just follow the procedure, get used to it, and then you're going to turn around and let it set, I think, for like five minutes, and then you're going to dump some of the sand off, and uh, dump the clay water, the water part, the clay that's suspended in the, yeah, you're going to dump it over it and see if there's any sand. You can actually run your hand down in the bottom to see if there's any sand falling. So, um, I don't know how many impurities in it. We'll find out. But, anyhow, uh, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Momo Tuna and Kuna Matata. You like my new hat? Yeah. Boss Man just spent $5,800 on an underground missile, and the guy came out and delivered the tool. And so, we uh, he threw us some new hats, and I'm like, hey... Nothing wrong with a new hat. Later.